Hello folks, welcome to Sherwood Park, Toledo, located at 31 Automall Road in Sherwood Park, Alberta, Canada. Today I'm going to be showing you this new Toyota Corolla Hatchback S. Now the most notable features on this S is its backup camera. You also have your Bluetooth connectivity along with your lane departure alert. Now I'm going to go through a couple more features on the inside and outside of the vehicle just to get you better familiar with this new Toyota Corolla Hatchback S. Let's get started. Now a couple of the exterior features that you will see on this S is its daytime running lights. And then if we take a look just over on the side here, you're going to see your 15 inch wheels. Now you also have your integrated signal lamps as well as your foldable mirrors, heated mirrors, vortex generators. The other nice thing is you do have the smart key system with it. So with the smart key system, you can lock all the doors simultaneously just by pushing on two little lines you see there on the handle. Push on it once, it'll lock all the doors automatically, and then if you put your hand between the handle, it'll unlock the front door for you as well. Now this is all possible just as long as you do keep the key fob on you at all times. And the color we're going to be taking a look at today is smoked paprika. Now to start off with, we're going to be taking a look at your front dash as well as your front seats just so you have a much better idea of how much space there is. Now you have your black cloth into your seat surfaces and if we take a look just over on your left hand side, you're going to see your automatic headlights as well as your window wiper de-icer. On the inside of your driver's side door, you'll see your mirror controls along with your window locks, power locks, window controls, both your front and rear windows. Now a couple of the controls you'll see here on the steering wheel include your scroll function back, Bluetooth, volume control, voice recognition, lane departure alert, cruise control, mode select, and your seek function as well. Now you do have the push button start, so all you have to do is put your foot on the brake, hit the push button, and it will start up for you automatically. Now taking a look at the multi-informational display, you're going to see a couple of different options on there. So if we take a look there, you are going to see a distance to empty with an exterior temperature gauge, you have a digital clock on there, and then scrolling through, you'll see your speedometer, as well as your fuel statistics, and a couple of other additional features include being able to go through your lane departure alert, trip info, and then your settings menu with your lane departure alert, pre-collision system, as well as a couple of other additional settings. And you'll also find your messages through here as well. Now taking a look at the center dash as well as the, the touch panel display, sorry, you're going to see a couple of different options with your home screen. You have a uh, three screen view of your radio station, fuel statistics, as well as your phone connectivity, digital clock, and then if we head inside the menu, you'll find your audio phone apps as well as a couple of other additional features. Now with the apps, it's part of the new Entune app suite, so as long as you have it on your phone, you can use such apps as the Slacker app to stream your music from your phone onto the touch panel display, or if you want to check local fuel prices or sports, it just all depends on what your personal preferences are. Now down below you have your automatic climate control settings, and if we take a look, it's mounted to an automatic transmission. And just to give you a quick idea of what the backup camera looks like, I'll just throw it into reverse here for you. So as you can see, you have those nice guiding lines on there making things much easier for you when you're trying to back into a stall. Finally, we'll be taking a look at your rear cargo area as well as your tailgate now. Located on the back of your tailgate, you'll find your backup camera just underneath your Toyota emblem. And located just down at the bottom here, you'll find your rear hatch release. Now I'm just going to close in on the rear cargo space just so you have a much better idea of how much room there is. Now the nice thing is you do have the cargo cover in the back here, so if you want to cover up your valuables just while you're going from place to place, you can use it this way. If you do need the additional space, you do have a 60-40 split for your uh, rear seat as well, just in case you do need the additional space. You do have some cargo space just located on your right and left hand side. And then if we take a look just underneath here, you'll see your spare tire as well as your jack and your toolkit. So if you do find yourself in a bit of a pinch, you know exactly where it's located. Thank you so much folks for watching this video today. If you have any questions on this new Toyota Corolla Hatchback S, Please visit us. We're located at 31 Automall Road in Sherwood Park, Alberta, Canada. The phone number is 780-410-2455. Or please visit our website at sptoyota.com to get us by email. 
Once again, folks, thank you so much for watching this video today. If you have any comments or any additional questions, please leave them in the comment section located down below. Other than that, make sure you have a great day, and I hope to see you next time.